So I have to start this video off with some sad news. And it's that I'm going to be missing a lot of the games this Saturday. Because I actually have homecoming this Saturday that I'm going to go to, which I guess isn't a bad thing. But I am going to miss some of the games, including Notre Dame, Stanford, and Ohio State, Penn State. And I'm really bummed that I'm going to miss them. But I'm going to try to catch as many of the earlier games as I can. Get some reactions for you guys. But I am going to miss Stanford, Notre Dame. I'm very upset about that. But... I know that I'll have a good time, and yeah, I just kind of wanted to say that, just so you guys don't expect a reaction, then you don't get it. I'm sorry that I'm going to miss those. I'm really bummed about it. But anyway, let's get into these predictions. There's been some shuffling at the bottom of the rankings that we'll talk about. UNC Miami, I'm going to take Miami in that one. Georgia and Tennessee, I'm a Tennessee fan, and they've been playing so badly. I'm going to take Georgia. Alabama and Louisiana. This was a tough one, but I think I'm going to take Alabama in a close one, 71-7. Clemson, Syracuse. For the second year in a row, I have the Cues. I don't know why. They've been playing very well lately. I feel like Clemson's going to overlook them again. I have Syracuse as my upset pick. Call me crazy. West Virginia, Texas Tech. I'm going to take West Virginia in a very close-ranked matchup. I think Will Greer is the real deal. Oklahoma, who was taken to overtime by Army of all people, they dropped to six. I'll take them in a bounce back game against Baylor. Texas and Kansas State. I'm gonna take Texas. They've been. I feel like Kansas State can hold it close, but I I do think I'm gonna take Texas in this one. They've been looking like a very good team since that ugly loss to Maryland. Pitt and UCF. I'm gonna take UCF. Um, I do like Pitt a little bit though. Auburn Southern Miss. I'm going to take Auburn in a pretty uh, good one. I mean, pretty decisive one. Uh, Florida and Mississippi State. I'm going to take Mississippi State in a close one. This one is actually going to be pretty good in my opinion. But I'm actually going to take Mississippi State. Duke and Virginia Tech. And Virginia Tech lost to freaking Old Dominion. I'm taking Duke. I'm, I'm glad they're not raked anymore. You should not rake a team after that. South Carolina and uh, Kentucky. I'm going to take uh, Kentucky in this one. They've actually been looked very well. Ben looked very well. They've looked very well. They looked very good. Uh, grammar is a struggle. I'm going to take Kentucky. They've looked impressive, but I feel like it's going to take a lot for them to get past some of the other SEC teams, but they might be able to do it. I'd like to see them do it, even though I don't like Kentucky since I like Louisville. BYU-Washington, I'm going to take Washington as BYU's ranked 20 now, which is a little surprising, but I think Washington's going to try to eagerly move up the rankings. I'll take them. Ole Miss and LSU, I'll take LSU. Ole Miss has really underperformed as of late. Oregon, who is up a rank after beating, after holding Stanford close, I'll take them against Cal. Now the two big games. Stanford-Notre Dame, which I'm going to miss. I'm going to try to catch as much of it as I can, like updates on my phone and stuff, but I'm going to take the Cardinal. I think they're the better team than Notre Dame. I don't really like Notre Dame that much. I think I'm going to have to take the Cardinal here. I'm going to make a preview video of this game. I will make a game preview. Trust me, I, I'm going to do that. That's, that's, that's happening. But I think Bryce Love can run over that Notre Dame defense. I don't know. Preview video will be coming later in the week for that game at Ohio State, Penn State. Penn State, for the love of Christ, please beat Ohio State. Please. I really hate Ohio State. I think they're overrated, cocky. I don't think they're as good as the number four ranking that they have. I'm going to take Penn State. I feel like the whiteout will get to them because that's what Penn State does is that whiteout. Preview videos will be coming for both of these games. Trust me. I, I, I can assure you that that's happening. Thank you guys for watching this week's picks. I'm sorry I'm going to miss a lot of these games. I do have homecoming from 6 to 10. I don't know why I run so late. But I'm going to try to catch as many as I can early in the day. And uh, yeah, NFL picks will be coming tomorrow.